Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. Dragon Link in the new TCG format, supposed March 15, 2021. Uh, you know, Dragon Link is pretty much untouched. Uh, LP is still there, PST is still there. Um... And uh, Konami decided to give back the, the Dragon Buster <laughs> for the Buster Lock. Um, even though Union Carrier uh, is gone, which, you know, was a big tutor to get it. Uh, you know, I will kind of lock your opponent out of the duel, at least out of their extra deck, which, again, like, kind of bypasses stuff like Dark Ruler no more, you know, and put up stuff like Boral Savage to negate Lightning Storm uh, evenly matched, which, again, are direct outs for the Buster Lock. It makes things much uh, harder for your opponent to, again, come back. Um, especially if you're playing Dragon Link as it was before, in our quote-unquote old format. The deck is untouched, made some small changes to Gabriel Nets. Um, this uh, first place deck is from the LCS a couple of weeks ago. But, uh, I mean, obviously it needs more testing, more uh, optimizing. Again, the format is a bit different. Um, not running too many hand traps, not sure if it's needed. But again, it's just a little shorter video compared to previously, but... I mean, it's still Dragon Link. It, it does the job well. You're playing so many extenders. The deck is still the same. The deck has the capability to play through multiple hand traps, to play through Nibiru with Halki, using the token for Halki. It, it's insane forcing an early Nibiru because of Appaloosa or the Savage. The deck is still uh, bonkers, right? And keep in mind, and that's a big difference, is that now you do have access to the Buster Lock to basically shut down your opponent from using the extra deck. So what's the thing is, is that there are a couple of ways to kind of search your Buster Lock or, you know, like send it to the graveyard. You have the, the, the what, is it, what is it called, the Buster Whelp, the Link 2. To kind of foolish it to the graveyard, or I think the much easier way is Helki. You know, just get it on the field, your whelp, uh, your buster, and um, it's, it's also a level one tuner, so it has the capability to put up a potential early savage. That's a potential thing with you know, like like any other level seven. You're running multiples of that in your main deck, or and that's a thing you could use it for LP, PST, whatever, right? Keep extending your place. Now the thing is, is that you might ask, is that how are you going to equip your whelp from the graveyard? Your, you know, your for the Buster Lock. Well, uh, there is a card called DMC, I believe the name is DMC Dragon. I believe the name is, and um, very similar to, I guess, Dragonities. It has the capability to directly equip something from your graveyard to any card on the field. Well. There you go. And um, LP is still there. LP has the capability to tutor out that dragon from the deck. And as you saw, the, the getting out like the Buster Lock, how it was before, is, is child's play. It's pretty much the same as it was before. You know, but maybe a little bit less less flexible because before we had the Union Carrier, which, which was exact, um, accessible <laughs> super easy. Now it's a bit harder because of DMC, uh, DMZ. But still, the deck basically plays the same. You're going for an early Savage or an early Appaloosa to kind of force your opponent to go for Nibiru, use up their hand traps. And if they don't, you have Appaloosa or Savage and, you know, kind of can play through their potential negations, right? That's a thing people might uh, drop down on the amount of hand traps. But um, if they see Dragon Link is still, if not the best deck in the, the upcoming TCG format, then uh, it's, it's yeah, people need more hand traps. Um, here I might have, you know, could have played it a bit different, um, you know, sacrificing Pisty, uh, maybe with Striker or, you know, going for Striker um, and eventually going for a rank 8 exceed play as well. But um, I mean, it doesn't really matter too much. The last example, again, playing through Nibiru, but again, Again, that's something that's not different. Uh, Romulus is still strong, either Ravine or the Extender in the form of a Dragoon. Not Dragoon. A Dragoonity monster. And that's as I mentioned before, DMZ Dragon is not a once per turn effect. So, as you saw, you can reborn it like twice, for example, or special summon it from your deck with LP. Uh, equip something, maybe the Dragoonity uh, card and unequip for an extra body. So, very similar to how Dragoonity works, right? A, dra a pure Dragoonity deck, like what happens here. Equip the Dragoonity. Yeah, indeed. Unequip for the potential extra body. And then, you know, you can use your DMZ for Pisty. And go from there, uh, eventually reborn it and, you know, equip with Buster Whelp. And that's, again, what happens here. Um, so, again, not once per turn. <laughs> you see, the, it's it's that easy. And the thing is, is that your opponent, okay, if they have Dark Ruler, okay, that's fine. The, the Buster Lock is still there. Your opponent needs more answers for that. So, uh, playing, this was only Nibiru, obviously, right? But, as you know, Dragon Link has the capability 
of playing through Ash Blossom, through Gamma, with Nibiru, also if your opponent has that, they definitely have the capability to do that because of their multiple extenders, and that's, that's just so scary. And keep in mind, now that, well, maybe if you were, uh, or nibiru your opponent's uh, Dragonling deck before in our current format, I guess, you you, you know, you ne didn't need to fear a Popping Shot Buster Lock, but now you do, <laughs> That's that's the big difference. Um, so uh, this should be game, right? Boral again, yeah, okay, yeah, the, the rocket uh, pop itself, potential special summon during the end phase, but yeah, this is more than enough to attack for a game. So Drangolink, I feel that this deck is probably going to be the best deck, but obviously needs more testing, now Virtual World is going to develop, Tritron is pretty much out of the picture, I guess, but the fact that the Buster Lock is so easy accessible, that's, um, I think that's a mistake. Okay, guys, that's it, thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a comment or a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave them signing out. Peace.